It's working. <laughs> Hello. We are going to JFAX 2018 today. Uh, we're all ready, but we had a little issue with the camera and figuring out where Preston is, but he won't be joining us today, which is okay. So it's just me and Autumn today, and then I think Autumn and Chelsea and Preston are going tomorrow. Uh, yeah. And then <laughs> it'll be full tree squad. It's branch squad, on. like until Sunday. <laughs> yeah. So we're gonna leave now. It's now uh, a lot later than <laughs> we thought we would be leaving at, but it's 2.15, so we're gonna leave now. Bye. Bye. <laughs> We made it. <laughs> that was a little stressful. <laughs> it took a little bit, but we made it. We're in where we just parked right now. We're probably we're gonna. Up, we're up. We had, we had... Oh, <laughs> we have a uh, We're gonna get our wiggos on. Oh. Hello, we just got to the con and registered, and we're gonna walk around the dealer's alley a little bit and then see if we're hungry and go to a panel like yeah. So we'll keep you up. Dealer there. alley, dealer alley. Dealer alley. Yes. These are like literally the squishiest animals ever. Like you can like, like go like that. Oh, this turtle. Oh. <laughs> it's precious. It's calling your name. I know. He saw that. We're at so Toys R Us. Oh my gosh. She's reading the new chapter of I Love You. This is like... <laughs> Get up. I wanted to run again, that was hilarious. Sort of stuff. So, uh, with that introduction out of the way, let's get some cues. You're first. Have you been to Vault of Midnight yet? Have I been to what? Vault of Midnight. It's right down the street. The I only just door. got here like yeah. two hours ago. <laughs> 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 you get the time to check it out. It's a nice comic book store. Oh, really? Yeah. Well, that is immediately appealing to me. <laughs> so, maybe I'll have to. Go for it. Um, if right you could punch uh -huh. any of the characters right, you've ever been, been excluding part. Bakugo, <laughs> consequence free, what would it be? If I could punch any character I've ever voiced, excluding Bakugo? Do you assume I would punch Bakugo? <laughs> yeah. I, mean, I feel like you're jumping to a conclusion here. It says, uh, other cues? Other cues? Otherwise, this is a very short panel, and we started early. So. Are you original? Sorry, about my what do you pick? Original starter Pokemon? Original starter. I always pick fire. So Woo! Charmander. Ooh. Yep. Nah, well, I know. Ow. So, right. let's go for it. Uh, is Bakugo turn evil? Do you know what is upcoming? No, Bakugo is going to be the number one hero. Uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> this one, I Shook. <laughs> Run. Go, Autumn. Did you see me jump? Yes, that run. Oh my gosh, my gosh. Use your gear. Yes. Yes. 
shook. I'm sending it to Colin. <laughs> so, I don't know, you don't really seem like the angry type, so... Mm. How... <laughs> how... How do you uh, get prepared to... <laughs> well... You know, yell, throw insults, just, be angry all the time. Just think about Justin Briner. <laughs> <laughs> um... This is like Justin's and my like ninth con together this year. I said to Colleen like just a few weeks ago we were recording some episode, and I was like, you know, Colleen, I was a little bit worried going going into season three because uh, nothing bad happened in my life beforehand. I wasn't I I haven't been I wasn't sure coming into the season that I was really gonna be able to bring that rage. And Colleen went, Cliff, you're just. And I was like, were you gonna say that I'm a naturally rageful person, Colleen? And she goes, I just think you're passionate. <laughs> uh, Cots keep calling you stupid and bastard and all of those fun words. Loser. Loser. <laughs> I don't remember that one. How deep does your friendship with him go? And is it too so we're best friends. You know, friends get to razz each other like that. They're like, oh, you stupid idiot nerd loser. And like, oh. You. <laughs> yeah, I do call you a nerd. Huh? Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> no problem. <laughs> oh, I'm, I am excited for this question. I can feel this one. Whirlpool. Is that what I'm saying? Like, like Whirlpool? Yeah. Wait. Yeah. I mean, you told me that story. You remember that? You told me that story. Oh my yeah. god, he remembers that. Yeah. What did you say in your Jenna's voice, Saitama looks dead sexy in a miniskirt. <laughs> <clears throat> Saitama looks dead sexy in a mini skirt. <laughs> Shout out to Travis. <laughs> Hypnotize people with my my dancing. <laughs> like you know, we're fighting, you see me like start swaying my hips, it's already done. <laughs> it's over. That's it. So I got you. <laughs> so yeah, we call that disco duck. Yeah, the disco duck. So. I swear, uh, like a long time ago, I thought of like this super cool one. I was like, oh, this is so unique, and <laughs> no one's ever thought of it. But uh, I don't know. I'd probably just do something lame, like like I wait what? Uh, <laughs> Probably, I don't know, probably like some sort of something with like sonic waves, like, uh, I don't know, I'd just scream and it would, the earth would blow up or something. Yeah, a little banshee action. <laughs> you know, if you do that a certain way, you could fly. Yeah, just scream. <laughs> no, 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 you gotta look down. <laughs> I'm doing it. <laughs> I can fly all over the place for free. <laughs> We're so ready to walk out the door right now because we're gonna rip our wigs off when we get outside. <laughs> oh. Yes! Okay, we're gonna go get something to eat and then go home for the night, so see y'all. We made it. And then 
like as soon as like we were like Literally, gonna leave. <laughs> this lady walks up with like five different badges. She's like we found some of these and some of these are extras and then literally she had Autumn's badge so it was like a yeah. miracle sent from literally. God. Yeah, it was like immediate like, <laughs> just had to share that. Miracle of the day. JFK is Innocent World, George's Pose. Her Bolero is by Baby the Star Shine Bright. Her socks and headdress are from Innocent World. Her bag is from Axis Fem. And her shoes are off brand. Look who we ran into. <laughs> Preston's lending her his fan because he's so nice. Because she's a monster high doll. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> It's Carmada cosplay again. I, I, I She's everywhere. <laughs> As uh, Todoroki. <laughs> it smells like fish. Nah. Oh, look at that beautiful convention center. Oh, I thought you were going to say beautiful Preston. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Chelsea's all the way back there. Per like usual. Mm. Just kidding. Not salty. Welcome out here at Academia. Photo shoot. <gasps> Lit. Appreciating this, like, you know, niceness. One more time. This decoration. What's going on? What is going on? Um, <coughs> we were trying to get some Starbucks. The one in the Amway Plaza Hotel is closed at 7. Of course. And everything that is in each hotel, there's like a Starbucks in every hotel around here that's connected by the Skyway. It's also closed at 7. So... We're gonna... <laughs> I downloaded Postmates because I thought, well, someone could deliver it to us. I'm okay, so, so that's salty. Not I downloaded Uber Eats. Uh, they don't have, they don't do coffee runs. Of course. Anyway, so now we're gonna go across the street to Big B. Support your local businesses. All right. No, this is Patrick. <laughs> you answer, you walk. <laughs> you <laughs> hey, which room is it in anyway? I think panel room three, and the top half of one is right after. Right oh, okay. So yeah. All right, let's roll. Right. 
And so if you don't keep yourself like in the back on your feet, if you don't keep a hurry, just click. And you hold it. I'm blue It was actually pretty, pretty good. And there are signings from two, at 2 30. And I have one joke for you guys before I go. Um, one last joke. Let's see. Do you like, have you heard my janitor joke? I love my janitor joke. Okay, well, Amy started it. Okay, so here's my janitor joke. What did the janitor say when he jumped out of the closet? Supplies! <laughs> I'm dead. She got him a drink. We're going to try to give it to him. Where you at? Did we go the wrong way? I feel like it's just stalker. <laughs> just trying to get him a drink. <laughs> I don't see his hat anywhere. See him down there. Did he go that way? I don't think he did. Maybe he's going to play video games. <laughs> oh. Where's he going next? Uh, he has a panel and main event at noon. Oh my gosh. Well, it's like noon, isn't it? No, it's wait. I mean, I mean, I mean one. Oh, one. Yeah. I love you too, honey. Going to the dealer's room. Ready to shop. You're all the way up there. <laughs> Crazy janitor. Oh. Zoink! This is so cute. We have a Wendy and a Peter Pan. Aww. And these little girls just got photos with them. And they're being so adorable. It's like so cute. Oh, and these Sailor Moon girls are so cute. Their outfits are adorable. Oh. Hamster. <laughs> what am I to oh my gosh. There's so much going on. <laughs> Oh. We're gonna uh, go back to the dealer's alley for a little bit and then um, uh, get an autograph hopefully from Todd and then take some pictures and watch the cosplay competition. Dude. Talk about that you're working on this. Don't get people excited about this. Don't let them plan ahead and save up for this. We want to spring it on them like a breakup. Uh, it's, it's very odd to me. I don't understand why it happens. Um, and these NDAs, it's not like, you know, it's not like Russia's sitting there like, oh, I heard Cliff is directing this thing now. Execute. <laughs> I heard Cliff Chapin is directing the next season of this show. I just found out on Twitter. Time to support it with my Russian minions. Like, no, it's not like, it's not gonna be like that. I don't understand why this happens. Zach, yeah, one thing that I, I get asked a lot, I'm sure that we all get asked, is like, what's, uh, you know, when, when you go into the booth, like for, for Zach, I've worked with Zach a couple times now. Um, from what I can see, there's zero prep. <laughs> but he does a great job. I think, I think people think that we do our, our stretches and, and, you know, we do our... Uh, Vocal warm up. Like, I think there's some vocal warm up. It's just yeah. waking up and starting to talk in the morning. But I think people think when we go through an American Ninja Warrior course before we get into the room, <laughs> we're ready to do it and we're warm. Did you come from a background of like, uh, where did you go? To, what, what's your background in terms of training and stuff like that for, for acting? Um, so I did a lot of uh, a lot of like on camera stuff when I was little. My mom would you know drive me all the way up to Hollywood and I would you know audition for commercials and print work and just you know all sorts of uh, fun stuff. Obviously when you're six years old like you're like oh yeah I'm gonna be making some big money. No you just you don't know what's going on but yeah, I did that. I did some theater. Uh, I just I, I did some like I started getting into you know voiceover and, and learning about how uh, my voice works, and I remember I used to have like the worst uh, range ever. Like I couldn't sing probably like anything at all. You know, like I could hardly hit any high notes. And then I started, you know, training my voice, kind of learning the proper, uh, you know, breath support and stuff, so that I'm able to scream. I know a lot of people who like who do screams, but they're like, ah, 
I'm screaming. Ah. So, uh, so basically, what you're saying is like your early work before you started really training, we should ignore, and even if we see it in the bargain bin, do not touch it. Yeah, don't don't go anywhere near it. <laughs> you just saved everybody some money. Good for you. I'm scared. It <laughs> has a special place in my heart, and I always kind of give this speech every year because I have to blame JFAX for all of this. Uh, <laughs> it's true that JFAX is actually where I started doing costumes and actually where I began to compete. And so seeing how much the competition just it grows, the people coming in each year, the people coming to view it, like it just it makes me so happy as a person who not only competed but also ran the competition for a while back when it was at the college. Um, if you remember me from way back yeah. then, yep, yep, that was me. Um, so I want to give a big hearty welcome to all of you and all of our cosplayers. So first, I would like to begin with a round of applause. This is for our cosplayers. Thank you so much for showing up and coming here and doing the whole getting judged stuff because it can be a little nerve-wracking. Academia, or as we also say, My Hero Academia. That's yeah, we. Wait, can we say that thing? That, the one. Yeah. Say that thing. <laughs> oh, wakes up 20 minutes before we leave. Says I'm gonna be Fluttershy today. We've been planning this cosplay for like a year and a half, and she's gotten like five pictures, and we've gotten zero. <laughs> Salty. <laughs>